I have a big round pump, and it's like this. It's called a Dutch oven. The sides are always deep on this, and you put whatever you want to bake. So I'm going to put in here um, pumpkin bread, and I would put that in there, or maybe in my rolls. Right now, on this big one, I have a bowl about the same size. That's four chicken breasts. That's one of the favorite entrees on your um, menu. That's in there. I use my handy dandy shovel. We definitely don't have these hanging around our house, except maybe we brought a snow shovel in today. And I get, uh, you can see through the logs how they'll burn down and create those really hot lumps. We call them coals. So I'll move that out of the way and I'll shovel some underneath. That's why you have the neat little legs. So uh, this pot can sit right down in there. Shovel a couple of couple shovels full underneath, put whatever I want to bake, return the lid. Now this uh, a new government. No, you did not have to meet in the summer of 1787 to establish a new government. You had no right to do that. You were there well, simply to amend the Well, I'll admit that we were not sent to Philadelphia to uh, establish a new government, but only to amend the Articles of Confederation. You overstepped your mandate, didn't you? Perhaps. What but be the first time? Now, hold on a moment. All the last. Uh, we all, at the convention, felt that it was our only recourse. Government. Government, the people, government, people, government. Well, my friends, I believe we could go on about this all night. All week. If you don't have nearly that much time, no, would your digestive tracts be able to handle that kind of activity during your dinner? So I should bid you all a fair adieu. Adieu. At least to most of you. Good evening to you, sir. Good evening.